This has been one hell of a week and a half, huh? I've been looking for a medium or some kind of avenue to talk about the protests and the movement because I didn't want to just use a black screen or a picture or throw up some dumbass Overwatch gameplay. It just didn't feel right. But I finally found something I definitely want to talk about. And it's One Angry Gamer's Traitors of America list. This list, oh man, I could talk about this list for, I guess we'll find out, huh? I've already looked at it a lot. I think it came out, I don't know. Let's see when the first comment is. Can I sort them? About a week ago, okay. A number of individuals, companies, outlets, and media institutions have stepped forward to announce that they support the group's enabling, enabling, riots, violence, vandalism, theft, assault, and murder taking place at the hands of vandals and thugs across the United States of America. Okay, first of all, this is really distracting. Distracting. Where's, why is my ad block not working? Second of all, I, I don't even want to get into this. I mean, they've already started out just on the complete opposite side of what you would want. So, if this is for you, anyone looking to find out which companies, brands, and content creators have betrayed the trust of its American people by aligning with groups that support the deconstruction of Western values, this list will enlighten you as to who the traders are so you can stay informed. When I first found this list, it was 475 companies, brands, and content creators. It was 475 of them. Now it is separated into companies, 479, and celebrities slash e-celebs, 350, or 348. So, almost 850, right? About age 130. <laughs> This is going to be a good video. Note, some of the people slash brands slash companies on this list are not headquartered in America. However, they still cater to and influence the American consumer audience. And in light of their influence to help sway the views of American citizens, they have been added to the list. Each of these is a hyperlink. Right? This guy, who... We will talk about what Angry Gamer is, how I think it's a group of people, it's not one guy. I've never heard of them until this, so I'm completely ignorant to their past. I'm just going to say it now. They're either the deepest undercover, like, onion wannabe trolls, or, like, alt-right incels. So, to me, it's either or. Like, I already clicked on, okay, hopefully this doesn't. Just please open a new tab. Thank goodness. 343's tweet. 343 Industries stands together with our fans, creators, colleagues, friends, and the entire African American and black community against systemic racism and injustice. We are proud to join with Microsoft in amplifying black and African American voices. How does that come off as supporting and enabling, uh, supporting the groups that enable violence? riots, vandalism, theft, assault, and murder when you have... This happened just in the last hour. Two police officers were charged with felony assault during a protest in Buffalo, and they were applauded by their colleagues as they left the courthouse. Officers Robert McCabe and Aaron Torgalski pleaded not guilty. They were released without bail. And we've been showing you the video of this. What side do you want to be on? Do you want to be on the side of the cops that push a 75-year-old guy who, quote-unquote, instigated 
and hits his head on the ground and is bleeding immediately. Do you want to be on their side? Or this guy's side, who did absolutely nothing wrong and is protesting peacefully and is rewarded with a trip to the hospital. This, this meme, this meme is everything, honestly. The traitors of America. I... Okay, before I go on a tangent, let's actually get into the list. So, one indicator that they're a troll is that <laughs> some of these parentheses are just hilarious uh, descriptions of the companies. Uh, let's go for the guys who stand out. Academy Awards, obviously, a traitor. Not sure why, because they've had a very controversial past with racism and protests and what has happened at their award ceremony, but apparently they're obviously a traitor. Um, AO1, from the 1990s, by the way, this is a good one. I'm going to Go through a few of these before I go into that tweet. Too bad Apple doesn't have any parentheses. Amazon is a double trader. Double trader means two tweets, so let's see what these are. Let's see. Ooh, a news article. Man, Amazon donates $10 million to organizations supporting justice and equity. God, doesn't that sound awful? Doesn't, wow, definitely going against the American way by doing that, you know? What's the second one? Oh, here's your tweet. Prime video, baby. Together we stand with the black community, colleagues, artists, writers, storytellers, producers, our viewers, and all allies in the fight against racism and injustice. Yep. What an awful thing just to tweet out. Astro Gaming, baby. We're in a pair right now. Atari Imposters. <laughs> what, what, what does that even mean? Imposters. 73,000 followers, 7 retweets, 29 likes. So many of these tweets are irrelevant as hell, too. And because this list got so popular, people were literally tweeting at him saying, add me to the list. That's where the celebrities come at the bottom, and that's probably why he separated it. But to me, this this comes off as like a hit list to some asshole who has a rifle and wants to put it to use. So I, I think this shit is scary. But let's move on. Um, Astro Gaming. Axe Body Spray. Hell yeah. Bandai Namco. Bandcamp. Bank of America. Okay. Dang, Best Buy doesn't have parentheses, but that's just a double trader. Yup. Blackout Tuesday. How awful. There's another total cynical point of view of this that does have some valid points to it, to where, kind of like coronavirus, near the second half of the um, like awareness part of it companies and people are bandwagoning it this because it's like a it's a fear that you'll get called out for not supporting and we've seen like influencers on Instagram and shit like post very disingenuous stuff where they actually don't mean it like the girl who got um, busted for pretending to help the um construction guy and then she immediately takes her mask off and strolls away in her mercedes like there's definitely an element of fakeness um and hopefully it's not too clear in this case we're kind of in the middle of it so but yeah that's something to look at down the line 
Um, a company with a tired face. I don't even know what that means. Boost Mobile. Toys for Thoughts and Training. Brats. Let's see what Brats had to say. Ooh, it's pink. Make your voice heard. Please sign the Justice for George petition. <laughs> yeah, let's sign the Justice for George petition and become traitors of America because we watched a man have a knee pushed into his neck for 8 minutes and 46 seconds because he bought some cigarettes with a $20 counterfeit bill. Earned it. Absolutely earned it. Christian food. Why does that matter? What? I, I, I don't even want to dive into that one. I really don't. Role-playing snowflakes. Somehow Crunchyroll got labeled as producers of High Guardian Spice. No, like, weeb attack. Very disappointing. Alright, we've gone through 100. Let's go to AOL.com. When I first saw this tweet, it had one retweet and two likes. 4 and 11. Okay, AOL has 170,000 followers. Let's look at their account. Nothing. 1 and 1. 3 and 2. 1 and 0. 1, 3, 1. <laughs> AOL could not be more irrelevant right but if you look at the replies <laughs> we find kgrand319 aka want the truth one two three first of all <laughs> granny please turn off the caps lock this account aol why let people dishonor our great president he spoke on tv with a bible in his hand because he is a christian man he is the greatest president we have had in decades. The left lies about every move he makes. We the people trust him with our country. Shame on you, AOL. What does this have to do with president? AOL, I've had an account with you for over 20 years. Dishonor and lie about our good president and you will have no followers. Attacking them for having no followers? They're already irrelevant. It actually couldn't get worse. But then you click on the account, right? Three and three in a year and a half. That is hard to do. And it's all just all caps. Just, I, I don't know. You, you can definitely go out of your way to find this shit. Here we go. Alright, so we see a representative tweeting out the footage of a 75-year-old guy getting pushed over who <coughs> instigated. And of course it's a problem. Capital B... I mean, well, that's hard. Oh my god. This is like... Look, I, you, I couldn't even do it. This woman's actually taking the time to do a space in between each letter. 99% of our police force across the country are black and white and red, yellow. There's red people? Is she talking about Native Americans? They control crime, so we live in the best country on earth. You don't know how they risk their lives every day, so you lay down and sleep in safety. Honor our law enforcement fool. Yep, a lot of safety out there right now. What the fuck is this? Oh. Is this a real person? This is one angry old woman. Oh, my brain hurts reading this shit. Oh, and then they tried to sell, sell a car. In uh, Virginia. Okay, let's please get out of here.
Here we go. This is some good shit right here. Dell Cheap PC Maker. Deviant Art. <laughs> I can't say this word. Fury? Furry? Furry. There we go. Furry Breeding Ground. Discord, another furry breeding ground. Alright, let's see what Discord had to say. First of all, it's a white screen cap. I'm not reading that. It's probably what everyone else said. How about DeviantArt? God, I love the What About Hong Kong, guys. Alright. Disney ruining childhoods. Oh, somebody didn't like Star Wars. Somebody doesn't like Ray. You know what? We're doing it. Green gamer. <laughs> Wait, what did that say? One angry gamer loses it over a lesbian kiss? Ah, see? Fucking called it, dude. I don't like Star Wars. Brr. No, I don't like Star Wars. They're ruining my childhood. <laughs> DoorDash is a delivery company, by the way, if you didn't know that. Does anyone know what this means? Failed at sock puppet math? Discount Pixar. I think they'll take it. The original Christian Nightmare. Damn, eBay doesn't have one. EA Sports should have been in the game right here. No sense of humor, to be honest. Guardian of Loot Boxes. What? By the way, if someone out there actually takes this list seriously and is planning to boycott all of this shit, I, well, you couldn't buy anything you, from anywhere. The only media you could consume is, like, Fox News, and you couldn't buy anything anywhere besides from, like, your local shops. Alright, where are we, or where are we? Is this fighting games, Evo? Hell yeah. Forever 21. Hey, Funko. Good. Game Informer, GameStop's bitch. And then this, it, I think this, it's stuff like this that makes me think that they're trolls. Because this is making fun of them where GameStop wanted to stay open in the beginning of, was it April, the end of March, where the lockdown happened. And it's like, <laughs> this is a funny joke to me. I don't know. Oh, I do want to know. That's all they did. All this account did was reply to an All Lives Matter tweet with, and it's the only one, and they're on the list. Oh man, these guys are dedicated. <laughs> Portlands creators and destroyers. Yay, gamers! Oh my god, yep, if you're gay, that's it for you, dude. Yep, fucking gay, man. I'm lucky. Oh, one of Angry Gamer does not approve of you. Google, evil. Oh, man. HBO Max, not HBO, but HBO Max specifically. The History Channel. It's hilarious seeing the History Channel on the right side of this. And then you have probation. Apparently Blackout Tuesday wasn't good enough to be a traitor, it was just probation. Legos for adults. <laughs> oh man. Instagram doesn't have a note? Damn, that's disappointing. Wow. Magic the Gathering. Well, I wonder if Yu-Gi-Oh is going to be on here. 
leftist news site. Let's see what they have to say. Oh, just hashtag. They don't have the NFL. Oh, I was going to say they have the NFL in here. They got to. Where's the NBA? How the hell is the NBA not on here? Update your list. Dumbass. Netflix left wing propaganda. For sure, for sure. Oh, this guy's on the wrong side. Update your list. Very important that this is in Japan. What did Nike say? Yeah, traitors in my book, for sure. I mean, Nike stayed with Kaepernick and helped him promote uh, him protesting and stuck with him. So, all aboard the Nike train, as far as I'm concerned. What else we got in here? Oprah Winfrey Network. O'Reilly Media? Bill O'Reilly? No, no. What a shame. Pokemon's greatest nemesis, PETA? What? What does that have to do with Pokemon? Pop Darts, baby. Pornhub subversion. I literally don't get it. Right over my big old noggin. Communism, Reddit, gotcha. I don't know how Respawn Entertainment got labeled as Titanfall developer when they just made Apex and Monofer 2. I really don't know how they pulled that off. Ooh, Double Trader. I really hope the Sesame Street is on the right side of this shit. Smart. Waning quality. Oh, Star Trek not good not anymore. Oh, see, look, look, I fucking knew it. Oh, ruining my childhood. Oh, feminist propaganda. Double traitor. Oh, Mary Sue. This is huge, though. I hate this. Look at this. The China one. He's. F mm. No, no, no. We gotta stay focused. We gotta stay focused. Taco Bell, a toilet's best friend. Once again. 10 out of 10 comedy. TikTok didn't get a note? That's boring. Uber is a spying taxi service, by the way. I thought that said Xbox is the second rate FPS for a second, and I was like, what? That doesn't make any sense. Alright, now we get down to the people. K-pop group, baby. Done. A Me Too hypocrite trader. Trying to... Really? Really? We're, we're already doing this? This is one of the funniest things I've ever seen. This is my kind of sense of humor, honestly. And it disgusts me that I think this is funny. Because only psychos like me would even point out in a document that somebody wore a microskirt to a funeral. 
Oh, man. Lax a butt. <laughs> oh, are you telling me that this guy, or that these guys aren't incels? BTS femboys cosplaying as male singers. You telling me these aren't incels? Oh, he's so mad that Chris Evans is on this list. He's so mad. Retweet. Oh. That's amazing. Impotent rage. Conan O'Brien way past his prime. Corey Balrog followed him on Twitter very recently because of this list. 10 out of 10. Feminist Star Wars author, he's so mad that Rey is good as she was. And it's a shame too, because you can actually constructively criticize the new Star Wars trilogy. Like, I think it's trash. And you can talk about Rey's character. But to use it here makes him look so bad. Does not help his case at all. Demi Lovato, deadass. Feminist Star Wars author, Demi Lovato, deadass. And then he, 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 whoever did this actually thinks they're funny. Actor who starred in Traitor. My goodness. Dances better than she tells jokes. Oh, man. Face clan, baby. Fake gamer girl. Oh, please. This is my territory. Twitch? Nope. This is the worst website in the history of life, by the way. Oh, so mad. I like Foo Fighters, the band. I like their music. I really related to them as a young fucking ticked off teenager. There goes my hero. Alright, this just dated them. Mid 90s. So he's probably. Oh, 40, of course. He's probably anywhere from like early 30s to 40. Pissed off white guy, just like the rest of them. I have no idea where I was. Okay, there we go. What else we got here? H3H3 H3 Productions. Disgraced. <laughs> Disgraced. I actually just finished Ethan's three hour viewing and retort of Gokunaru's hour and a half video on him. So I'm all caught up to date on that drama. And uh, I stand him. He can He he knows what he's done wrong, and he dismisses the out of context bullshit. Him laying into Jontron was fucking whack. He was nervous as hell with Bill Burr. He shouldn't have said the shit he said with iDubs. And he knows all that. We stand, Ethan, for sure. Why is Halsey confused? Only talented member of One Direction. <laughs> Is this a sign of respect on this list? Oh man, I just seen it still around. Somehow Iggy Azalea didn't get a note. Wow, that's so lame. James Charles, catfishing heterosexual men. How did I get full screen? What did I do? Oh no. Okay. <laughs> Is he wrong? I'm about to read. Yep. Easy retweet. Former sex symbol. Damn. Labeling much? Opportunist. Opportunist. Well, productive thought. Jenna Marbles is not a thought. Are you fucking retarded? Blacked.com dream hire. Ooh, a screen cap with.
the circle. With the circle. One hit wonder. I'm fucking deaf now, man. What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, this is such a roast. Oh man, Puberty's voice paid to laugh. Former free speech advocate. Oh, J.K. Rowling's could have been a lot meaner. Raise simp. Good lord. Homeschooling gone. That's what you get out of. Oh, misguided. That's what you get out of Beaver. How's how's that misguided? How is this misguided? Oh, and then oh, they love it. New with the graph. Oh my god. The ratios in these are always incredible. Taylor Swift's worst nightmare. Why? Really? We're, we're we're doing Taylor Swift to Kanye? What fucking year is it? We're roasting Kevin Bacon in 2020. And Sheva. Back to back confirmed kills. I'm only in the L's. How did Lele Pons not get a fucking... Parentheses better than that. Chasing relevancy. <laughs> Burned. Senior breastfeeder. He is so mad about Star Wars. He hates his former hero, Luke Skywalker. Oh my god. My boy Max is on probation because of a uh, because of that tweet. Yeah, dude, Traitors of America, referencing one of the best ever. Black, white, brown, white, unity, whatever colors, no colors. Yeah. Nate shot esports. Get, wait, no, he owns the fucking esports team. Golfing expert. This makes me think he played golf with this guy and like lost or something because this guy has nothing to do with golf. Or I'm just missing out on the best inside jokes of all time. Used to be the best in the business. Man, it hurt him to put Nolan North in this freaking screen. He was probably sobbing while typing that name. Oh, this should be great. I like fat bait. I want to see some fat bait. Well, so far, I don't feel like pulling my wiener out. It's a woman? Nice. So she is fat bait. So she had thought. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Mm, nope. These are all guys. Okay, here we go. Mm, not doing it for me. I mean, it's a great picture and she's hot, but I don't know if I'm getting baited into fapping. Is that a fucking nipple? Okay, okay, let's get out of here. Playboy's Bayonetta. What? How did PewDiePie not get one? Ooh, Uber thought. Who's an Uber thought? Yup. Horrible. Betraying America. Who? How did Pokimane only be thought? Damn, dude. I want this list updated. Randy Orton didn't even get anything. No Borderlands mentioned? 
I thought that he ruined Borderlands. Is Joe Rogan on this page? We love Joe Rogan. I mean, I've listened to... Oh, Seth Rogan. He's a leech. I've listened to Joe Rogan for like less than 10 minutes, so... Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Sonic Fox, worst human being on the face of the planet. In my humble opinion, I would say Sonic Fox is in my top five human beings on the planet. Let's see, what's his bio? I'm a black, non-binary fury. I can't say that fucking word. Who mix your shit in fighting games. Player for evil geniuses. Business inquiries. Okay, we don't need to know that. 200,000 followers. One of the best fighting game players I've ever seen across multiple games. I was going to say his. I'll do the thing. Their ability to switch from all offense to almost unbreakable defense when it matters it from Dragon Ball Z to Injustice Mortal Kombat am I missing a game kind of popped off in what at some point Street Fighter 5 I'm not sure but and then outside of the game stands for all of the same same things I basically stand for and they're the best. Love Sonic Fox. So, of course, this person thinks the opposite. <laughs> I looked at this name and I was like, this is such a random ass insult. And then I click. It's freaking Pro ZT. Like, some of the best, one of the best Vine guys ever. I never even have a Vine account, but this dude is fucking hilarious. And apparently he's an actor who hasn't been in any, any major movies. The Pussycat Dolls. Strippers pretending, pretending to be singers. The Rock. You used to be most electrifying man in entertainment. Oh, he liked the rock too. He liked those big old pectoral muscles. Human Kendall. <laughs> this is easily the worst double standard you could probably ever find. It's always unwise to seek political advice from someone who gets paid a hundred million dollars a year to bounce a ball. Oh, and LeBron and Kevin, you're great players, but no one voted for you. Millions elected Trump to be their coach. So keep the political commentary to yourself, or as someone once said, shut up and dribble. Well, he's allowed to have his view about what kneeling and the flag means to him. I mean, he's a person. He has some worth, I would imagine. I mean, this is beyond football, though. This is totalitarian, totalitarian conduct. This mm -hmm. is Stalinist. And by the way, on the streets of New Orleans, we're looking at live pictures. They're yep. shouting F Drew Brees. Wow. That's what, that's amazing that's to what me. this moment has done to the beautiful team is, spirit of the New Orleans This Saints. is a great, he's a great Christian man. He's I think the ending of that video is the best part. They love pulling the fucking Christian card. Oh, religion, that's a whole different topic. And one thing to note here is how, how do you take anything Drew Brees has to say seriously now? He said that dumbass shit, and it sounded very genuine. Immediately apologized, but kind of deflected it. The president agreed with him, which was hysterical. And then people were still on him, so it comes off as a PR stunt because a lot of his teammates are black, and he lives in, in you know, the place for the New Orleans Saints, and they're trying to win the damn Super Bowl this year. He replies to the president saying no, and it's like he's completely switched sides in, like, what, 48 hours? 72 hours? How can you believe him? You want to believe him, but in this day and age, with how people, fast people can flip-flop with apologies and social media and PR nightmares and I, 
as This isn't hyperbole either. This isn't a lie. He ran over a protester who ended up dying. And he's standing around, not in handcuffs, smoking a goddamn cigarette. And then you have shit like this. Turn around, put your hands on your back. Let's go. Spread your, your feet. Spread your feet. Spread your feet, man. Spread your feet. Palms together, please. Don't, don't fight, man. Ain't nobody palms fighting. Together. Don't palms fight. Together. You're palms fighting, together. man. Fuck you up, bro. You're fighting, man. Ain't nobody fighting. Fuck you, man. <laughs> Fuck you, man. Fuck you, Fuck you, bitch. Fuck you, bitch. Right there, I need a backup. Come on, then. Fucker. What's wrong with you, bro? Quit, motherfucker! Right, come on, man. Quit! Fuck you! What the fuck is wrong with you, motherfucker? What the fuck's wrong with you, motherfucker? Frank. Frank. What the fuck is wrong with you, dumbass? Shut the fuck up! Can you put your hands behind your back, please? You're not cooperating. Shut the fuck what up! What the fuck is wrong with you, my boy? Shut the fuck up! What the fuck is wrong with you, dog? Shut the fuck up! Hey, chill, chill, bro. Chill up. What the fuck is wrong with you, dude? Shut the fuck up. 453, 415, man. Chill out, right? You fucking grabbed my hand, motherfucker. You're fighting. I didn't grab your shit. You grabbed my hand. You're fighting, man. <sighs> Ain't nobody fighting. Fuck you. Yeah. Man. Grabbed his hand. 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 Yeah. They, well, apparently this is harassment if you're standing in front of my you face like that. That's some real harassment right there, bro. Record this, bro. Go ahead. Why are you harassing me? What am I doing to you? Because I looked your direction. Stop sit there. Because I looked your stop direction. Bad dog. No one's moving. No stop one's moving. I never moved any stop direction. Dog. Well, then stop. Okay. What are you coming at me for? I looked at your direction. Touch Who's touching again. you? Yeah. Who's touching you? You're in front of me. You're you're in my personal space. What do you mean? You have personal touching. Space. Yes, I do. It's my constitutional right to have my own personal space. What do you mean I have no personal space? Keep mad dogging me. No one's mad dogging you. They're looking in your direction. Keep mad if you don't know what that is, then you need to fucking go black classes, retard. Excuse me? You heard me. Turn around. For what? Turn around. For He's what? getting arrested for it. Turn around. What am I getting arrested for? Turn around. What am I getting arrested for? I'm asking you. Let what, him know. What am I getting around. arrested for? Turn around. What am I getting arrested for? Turn around. What am I getting arrested for? Oh, you say he's being detained, right? What's he being detained for, officer? I said he's being held in handcuffs until we figure out what he's doing. That's funny. I'm telling you. All right, yeah. Crime has happened. Okay. He's been detained for a crime. Crime just occurred. Okay. Obviously, some crime against me just occurred. What's he's detained right now. Okay. Crime. What's fucking wrong with you, dog? Shut the fuck up. And then this kid gets shot in the face for standing still. He gets shot in the head by a beanbag. I'm not even. No, we're not gonna watch this. This is literally just. No. Nope. Nope. Away from me. Hey, leave her alone. Do not touch her. Do not touch her. She has nothing. Do not touch her, sir. Leave her alone. Sarah, just walk away. Hey. Hey, get off of her. Fuck you. Just get out of here. What? Hey! What the fuck? I... It's one angry biker right there. So we'll see if that's a thing. One angry biker. Hell yeah. Fuck. <laughs> I'm losing it. I'm losing it. What side do you want to be on? What side do you want to be on, honestly? Really enforce the uh, 
um, citywide curfew shutdowns where we can arrest anybody who's walking around. Okay. My command wanted me to come talk to you guys and request mm -hmm. that you guys secrete either inside the business mm -hmm. so or in your vehicle somewhere where it's not a violation. I don't think we can, yeah. so we don't look like we're playing favorites. Gotcha. We can go into your. Yes. Why is it always middle aged? White dude. Why? Why? Then this, this, this is just a gold mine. This is all annoying too, because like... Uh, I want to talk to you guys about how I made the top five, and... How they've low-key botched this whole competition for the Overwatch League May May 8. May melee edit, and I want to talk to you guys about the video I made that y'all should watch right here. And I enjoy doing the VOD reviews of the professional play, but it just feels like none of this shit matters. All that matters is checking or watching the news a dozen times a day to see what psychotic shit is happening in this country and it seems to only be escalating and I don't know where we're gonna go from here from here it, man the pessimist and me ooh, you don't want to hear what I think is gonna happen with all this so GG's I guess it's Unbelievable how divided a country and even world we've turned into. It is so us versus them. And it's not, you know, black versus white. A lot of the problems happening right now are because any color of person is uniting to defend not even all black people, because there's people like Candace Owens out there that are just a whole different story. And this is really boiling into just... It, it's such a... What's the... It's so hard to put into words besides saying us versus them. And I'm all for it. Unfortunately... It's not a healthy mindset, because you end up assuming that everyone is the enemy, but how can you not, man? How can you not?